Welcome, 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 guys. This is the Federal Punch Ammunition 9mm Personal Defense Ammo. This is a really cool ammo. It's not what I personally run in my firearm, uh, but it's not something that I wouldn't run in my firearm. I just have ammo currently in my magazines. I'm not going to switch them out because I had just put it in. Um, I was able to find this at a store. It's not something I can typically find around here, at least readily available. So uh, when I did see it, I obviously grabbed a box so I could do a review on it. Um, I actually grabbed a couple boxes. That way I could shoot it and give you an honest review. Uh, the ammo shot great out of my firearms. One thing I like about this is it does have a brass casing. I'm a huge reloader, so I love when I can find brass ammo. Uh, a lot of casings, you know, are being switched over to different uh, uh, metals such as aluminum. That's not my favorite. Typically, you're not going to find aluminum uh, self-defense or personal defense ammo. Uh, typically, you are going to find something more like this, which is really nice. The other thing that you might find is something more um, kind of like a Sig Sauer cartridge. Actually, I have a box of that too, so let me grab that and lay it out here so you can see what I mean. Uh, if I can open it. So, you have nickel plated as well, um, but we're not talking about the Sig ammo right now. We are talking about this Federal Punch. So let's just kind of break it down. When we bring this cartridge right over here, you can check it out. It's pretty neat. Nothing fancy when you first look at it. Uh, but the biggest thing is when we look at the tip. Now, one thing is because it's cut down a little bit lower than what most of your, your self-defense ammo is, it's going to be a little bit bigger right at the start. And there's a little lines that's cut actually into your jacket right here. So when it does open up, it's gonna open up really nice and large. Even though it's a nine millimeter, this is gonna do some serious damage. So let me just dump out some of these so you guys can actually take a peek at them. So what we have is a really cool cartridge. This comes in 124 grain. So it's gonna be heavier than what most standard, I'm gonna say standard nine millimeter ammo is, which is 115. Now, I'm not real concerned about that. Generally speaking, what's going to happen when you have a heavier projectile is you're going to allow more powder to burn off behind it. So your gun will probably cycle better and without any issues. So if you've ever had like a jam or a fail to extract or something out of your gun, especially a new gun, more than likely it's because your springs weren't broken in. 124 grain is going to help break in your firearm a little bit faster. So if you do have a newer gun, using a heavier grain projectile like this Federal Punch might be your route to go. Overall, for ammo, I do think Federal makes some premium ammo out there. It's not cheap. I don't remember what I actually paid for this box, um, but it's definitely not cheap ammo. They work really well. It still has your jacket around the entire projectile, which is really nice. Uh, the downside is this is lead. Um, yeah, I, there's nothing wrong with lead, guys. Lead works wonderfully. Uh, but there is a problem with lead with little kids and not that children should be getting their hands on ammo. But let's say you go shoot and you have some of that lead on your clothing or something. Uh, this is a true story that happened to my daughter. So when I would go to hold my daughter after shooting, her lead levels were actually higher when she was a baby. And that's because of all that, you know, the, the micro lead that would be on my clothing. And then when I would hold her, she'd put her hands in her mouth eventually. So her lead levels in her blood were higher. That's the only downside I'm going to say about this ammo. And that has nothing to do with the ammo at all. Just change your clothes if you're going to go out shooting. And uh, you don't need to worry about that. As far as having that, uh, that jacket on there for the metal over the lead, that is going to help keep everything in. So it's not going to be as messy. So that is a huge bonus. But again, Federal makes amazing ammo. They did not do anything short on this. This is incredible ammo. If you find it at a local gun store, definitely pick up a box, start carrying it. Take care. Thanks for tuning in. If you guys have a different ammo that you actually run in your everyday carry, leave it down in the comments. I'd love to hear what type of ammo you guys are running.